Hello, welcome to PlayStation Access, my name's Nathan. PlayStation 4's firmware update 5.50 is on the way, and with it comes the ability to import your own custom wallpapers from USB, access new parental controls, and loads more. Let's take a look at the six things you need to know about firmware update 5.50. Number one, playtime management. The new Playtime Management feature enables parents, i.e. a family manager or guardian, to set time limits around PS4 use for child family members. This is in addition to existing family controls on spending and content and allows a family manager or guardian within a family on PSN to set individual time limits for child family members that can track daily usage and can either notify the player when their time is up or log them out automatically. Number 2. Custom Wallpaper via USB One that a lot of people have been asking for, this is the ability to import images directly from USB to use as wallpapers on your PS4 home screen, as well as zoom, clip and preview the image so it looks just the way you want. Number 3. Improvements to the library Update 5.5 also brings with it a new set of filters to more easily navigate your library of apps and games. This content can now be easily sorted into PS Plus games, entertainment apps or customised folders like PSVR games. You can also list content according to install date and recently used, making it easier than ever to find what you're looking for in your growing collection. Number 4. Better Manage Notifications Another much requested feature, this does exactly what you'd expect, adds the ability to go into the options menu on the notification screen and delete them, either one by one or in bulk when they're no longer useful. Number 5. Quick Menu Improvements You can now access and filter custom friends lists through the quick menu, making it easier to message friends when you're setting up or playing a game. And if you like having a custom playlist running while you play, there's also a new shortcut to control the volume of Spotify on PlayStation Music or the media player from the menu as well. Number 6. Super Sampling Mode PS4 Pro users taking part in the beta will see a new super sampling mode under settings, which enables those without 4K TVs to enjoy an improved visual experience when playing some PS4 Pro enhanced games that output higher than 1080p on PlayStation 4 Pro. With super sampling mode, these games are rendered at a higher resolution and then downscaled to match the HDTV, so when you're playing a higher resolution game, you might notice enhanced image clarity on your existing HDTV. Until this point, super sampling modes have been built into certain games directly, but now that it's supported at a system level, once enabled, any game that can output higher than 1080p will automatically be super sampled. And that's it, 6 things you need to know about PS4's new firmware update 5.50, which also comes with loads of other additions and improvements. Let us know what you think about the update in the comments, do like this video if it was useful, and subscribe to Access for loads more on everything PlayStation.